solemn response, rhythmic warm-up. I will give you a one-bar pattern, bar meaning one, two, three, four quarter notes, and then you will give me that rhythm right back. Renee's going to do it at the same time as you do, so we don't get confused. And away we go. Imagine if I stay in. And back to our 
too hard. It doesn't matter what you do. And shake. And one more shape, slow. Now you're gonna do it faster. We go shake, two, three, four. Shake, two, three, four. Shake, two, three, four. Shake, two, three, four. And shake, and shake, and shake, and shake. Four, three, two, one. Good, take a bow. Nice job, dancers. Let's go, two times. All right, so. We're warm, we're ready to start learning the material for week two of percussive dance, and then we're going to go back and review what we did in the first week. So if you're new to the material, great. You're learning this for the first time alongside everybody else. If you did the first week, it'll be a little extra familiar when we go back and review. So we're gonna start with the two scoop step. Just like the good old cereal raisin brand, we have two scoops in both of our hands. And we're gonna start by scooping to the left. So we have scoop together, scoop together. Then we have what's called a scuff. If you have ever scuffed your shoe on the ground, you're kicking with your heel, scuff, and then you have a hop. A hop is jumping from one foot to one foot. Hop, ball, change. So we have two scoops. Ball change. So, two scoops, then step, scuff, hop, ball, change. And then we're going to switch our direction going to the right. Scoop and scoop and step, scuff, hop, ball, change. What is a ball change, you ask? Excellent question. I'm glad you asked. A ball change is stepping on the ball of your foot and then changing your weight. So, ball change from one foot to the other. Let's try it again. To the left, two, scoop, step, step, scuff, hop, ball, change. Other way, scoop, step, scuff, hop, again, go scoop, scoop, step, scuff, hop, ball, change, scoop, scoop, step, scuff, hop, ball, change. Now we have our next step. This is called a three-step turn. So a three-step turn, exactly what it sounds like. It's a turn. One, two, three. It takes three steps to accomplish. So let's try that again the other way. Now, one helpful metaphor is the steering wheel. Yeah? So pretend you're holding a steering wheel in front of you. I'm going to be mirroring you as you turn around to the left. Renee is going to be doing the movement as you do it. So as you turn, one, two, three, you want to keep the steering wheel going in that same direction and then go back the other way. One, two, three. Nice. So, if I turn with you, if we're turning to the left, we have one, two, three, and touch, and then back, two, three, and one, two, three, together. One, two, three, together. Good. One common thing that people do is instead of stepping forward, they'll step back. So, I'll show you. Brush, do you want to do it the way you just did it? Sure. Now I'll do it the other way. So instead of stepping forward, a lot of people go back, around, step, back, around. Now that's not necessarily wrong, it's just a different move. So you want to make sure you're driving your car forwards and driving, stepping forwards, then when you are turned around, you step back together. So you're repeating the same direction. Nice. Good. So. We start with a three-step turn to our left, and we're gonna go three-step turn. Two claps, left, other other direction. Okay, the left, two, three clap. We've done it three times. Then we have crazy knees. So you touch them, you cross, switch them, switch them, switch them, switch them. Maybe you've seen this before. Hands on the knees, hands on the knees. Yeah, I call it crazy knees because it looks crazy and it's my knees. <laughs> so, then we restart with the scoop steps back from the start, traveling to our right. Scoop, step, scoop, step, step, scuff, hop, ball, change. Scoop, step, scoop, step, step, scuff, hop, ball, change. Now three, step, turn, three, clap, three, step, turn, three, clap, three, step, turn, three, clap. Crazy knees, crazy knees. 
Nice. So, that whole phrase will happen two times, both directions. So we'll start with our scoops going to the left, go back, three, three steps, crazy knees. Then we start scoops to the right, and scoop, three step, three step, three step, crazy knees. Let's, Let's do just try. I think we should try all of that together. Start with two scoops to the left. Six, seven, eight. Scoop, scoop, step, step, hop, ball, and a scoop. Scoop, step, step, hop. Three step turn to the left. To the right. To the left. Here we go. Crazy knees, crazy knees. Here we go. Second side, scoops. Seven, eight. Scoop. Scoop, step, step, hop, ball, chain. Scoop, scoop, step, step, hop, ball, chain. Three step to the right. Three step to the left. Three step to the right. Three to the right. Nice. Should we try that one more time? Yeah, I think so. Great. Starting with the two scoops to the left, left side. Here we go. Seven, eight. Three-step turn to the left. Two claps. Two claps. Crazy knees. Crazy knees. Two scoops. Step, step, hop. Ball, ten. Scoop. Step, step, hop. Three-step turn to the right. Left. Right. Crazy knees. Crazy knees. Oh, I got the crazy knees. Nice. Right. Now we're going to learn the third step. The monkey step. You're gonna start with a big step on the left leg. Shoo. Ha. Clap underneath it. Then other leg. Shoo. Ha. Now you're gonna step back onto that left. Step, clap, hit, hit. So you're falling towards your left and brushing that direction. Step, clap, hit, hit. Yeah, I'm gonna come a little closer so you can see really up close. Step, clap, hit, hit. Nice. So we start. Left, right. Step, clap, hit, hit. Step, clap. So it, the rhythm of it, one and two and three E and the four and one and two and three E and the four. One, ha. Nice. So that will happen four times. After we finish our second set of crazy knees, we have four monkey steps. Nice. It won't be that fast. <laughs> but just so you know, we can get a sense for how it sounds. Mm -hmm. So let's do the monkey step one more time, starting with our left foot and going through it four times. Six, seven,
Now we're going to attach it onto week one material and just get it all connected and see if we can brush off some of that other movement. So we start with the group step on our left foot. We'll do the whole thing a little slow. Six, seven, eight. Step, clap, step.